Paper Sparrow. Today we will learn how to make a flying paper sparrow. For paper sparrow, we need five fry wooden sticks, ice cream stick, two plastic sticks, two plastic wing supports, one plastic base, polypropylene sheet, one plastic tail, axle lever. Procedure. First, take an ice cream stick. Here we have the base and tail of a sparrow. There is a hole in the base. Put an ice cream stick in it. On the other side, attach the tail. Now, take the axle wire, place a small stick in it and pass the axle wire from the hole of the plastic base. Base below the ice cream stick. As you can see, there were two holes above the base stick, placing a plastic shoulder ring in it. At the back side of the shoulder holes, there is a hole, place fry sticks in it like this. There is also a hole in the shoulder wing and tail, place a stick in all of them. After placing all the sticks, it looks like this. Take a polypropylene sheet and cut a semicircle on it, whose radius is 20.5 cm and total diameter is 41 cm. Now take the tail sheet and attach it with tail sticks with glue. After that, attach the feather to the wing sticks. Now, attach the small plastic sticks with feathers. Bend the wire like a hook and place two rubber bands in it and attach another side to the tail hook. Our paper sparrow is ready to let test its lever. Rotate the key or lever clockwise or anti-clockwise. As you rotate, it from bends on the rubber band by increasing its elasticity and it works like a key toy. Now, rotate the key and throw it like a plane in the air to see if it flies or not. The triangular shape of a sparrow's tail is due to the arrangement and spacing of the tail feathers, also known as rectrices. The triangular shape provides bird with several advantages including better stability and control during flight. Rubber When you stretch a rubber band and rotate it from one end, the rubber band will likely twist and coil around itself as it rotates. This is due to the elasticity of the rubber and the way it responds to the forces being applied. The rubber band has a mass of 1.09 grams. This puts a specific energy at 1651 joule per kilogram for stretching and 6605 joule per kilogram for twisting. This stretch due to rotation rotates the axle. An axle is a mechanical component that serves a pivot point allowing rotational movement around a central axis. The rotation of rubber band rotates the axle as a result of its small plastic which was attached to the axle moving the feather up and down. So for more interesting videos like this, please subscribe to our channel.